Okay, dear students, let us see what is there in this question. The graph shows the power dissipated in a resistor of 100 ohm when connected to an alternating current power supply of root mean square voltage that is 60 volt. And the graph is in front of you. Fine. What are the frequency of AC power supply and the average power dissipated in the resistor? Just a moment. The question was not that very visible. Yes. So you want to comment upon the frequency of the AC power supply and the average power. So clearly, first of all, for the average power, we clearly have a formula. This is just a simple circuit that they are referring to. This is the alternating current AC and this is the resistance R. So clearly the power supply will be VRMS square divided by R. So VRMS is 60 square divided by the resistance, which is 100. And 60 square will be 3600 divided by 100. Clearly, 36 watt should be the average power dissipated. So the answer will be either A or B. And like, just remember this, it's like simple formula. But we are only going to use the root mean square value here. And you would be getting the average value there. Okay. Now, so we want to comment on the frequency also. So my dear students, power, when we're talking about the power, it's just like talking about the energy. And so you must be remembering the kinetic energy graph in the topic 4.1 for the simple harmonic motion when there was sine theta, sine omega t or cos omega t variation going on. This is exactly the same thing. You just call it alternating current and that is simple harmonic motion. But technically, mathematically, all are the same. So when you're talking about energy, definitely the variation of this energy and the variation um, of uh, power will be the same. So clearly, even in that case, the frequency uh, was double in the case of uh, energy. So we can say that the oscillation is getting completed in the time period this. So this is the capital T and this is actually T by 2 for the oscillation. So the time period actually is 0 0.04 and accordingly the frequency will be 0 0.04 which can be taken as 100 divided by 4. Clearly it will be 25 hertz. So clearly the answer will be A. I believe you remember that kinetic energy graph like this because that is going to be the square of the sine theta or square of the cos theta kind of thing so it is having this kind of a variation i believe you understand what i'm saying if you have the problem in understanding that please make the comment in the comment section i will try to explain it even even then okay so this is professor varun and um, this is how we do this question let us verify the answer from the mark scheme and yes the answer is a so this is how we do this all the best Bye.